fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yermak can't handle the repairs alone. So, once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably garrisoned the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge. What do I even do about this? There you go, Artyom. As I always said, you lucked out with me.
You pretty amazing, Bratuha. That was crazy. I mean, those mutants are pretty hardcore. The villagers I never have a chance against them. You? You just cut through them, bleh. Well, it's pleasure to meet you. Name's Christ, by the way. Are you from the train? Bet the locals wouldn't even talk to you guys. <laughs> Open fire right away, didn't they? <laughs> of course, those dumb bastards. I've been here long enough to know the drill.
They have a cult over there that dumbasses are hung up on technology having destroyed the old world. So they don't exactly take kindly to smart guys here. And me, well, they were just gonna lock me up until I agreed to go fight those electrical demons of theirs to absolve my sins. Because I was in cahoots with Satan, apparently, blyad. <laughs> Some Satanist I am. <laughs> I've been fixing engines and trading all my life. Now, now I'm moving to the east. Blin, I'm sick of this part of country. There's just nothing to do here anymore. The cities are gone. Bandits, beasts all around. Lots of space across the Volga, though. Plenty of opportunity. So, I came here with my rail car full of trading goods, hoping to make a few sales on the way east. What a fool I was. I was lucky to get out alive. <laughs> anyway, since you've arrived, I've been thinking of this little plan I had, never had a chance to pull off alone, but since you guys are also going east... Now, judging by what I could see with my binoculars, it's a miracle your engine is still running. Oh, by the way, take the binoculars. I'll show you where everything is. Look at the bridge first. See that section on top? It should lower if the emergency mechanism still works. Katya from the church should know better. I've never been to the bridge myself. There, to the right, that huge hangar. That's a terminal blade. The cult is considered a holy place. Covered it all in graffiti, schmafiti. There, <laughs> tarfish live there, you know. Stupid bastards. Even further right, see the building near all those carriages? Used to be a train depot. There are some bandits there now, but the place itself ain't bad. Oh, the area nearby isn't too bad either. There's a good hunting and stuff. I set up several safe camps around there. If you find them, you could rest, fix your equipment. <laughs> Unless you prefer spending nights at an open campfire. Now, come on, let me show you my home now. My cave. And this is what I need. Not a palace. What? Oh, here's a bed. So if you're tired, my home is your home. I made a workbench to tinker on. If you need ammo, grenades, there's some uh, raw materials here. So help yourself. You can have anything you like here. Can't carry all the shit anyway. <laughs> Come on, don't be. Oh, anyhow. I gotta tell you, this isn't just a pretty face. I've got a whole lot of knowledge stored up in here. And look at these hands. They know how to fix stuff. You'll never have second thoughts about picking me up. to buy some smokes from the villagers before the assholes chase me away, man. No, you could take the zipline down. Just hook up and uh, away you go. Dumb cretins didn't like my light. Yeah, I've been bent from the village and the bridge ever since.
Artyom, I heard you call me. It was so great there. <coughs> but I heard you and couldn't leave you.
We have to tell the others that we found her, Sam. It's good Artyom found me. Oh, what is this place? See the barrels? They're chemicals of some kind. This place is either for storage or it's a dump. And that short could have been put there by the locals to mark the spot. Thank you, my love. Oh, okay. All right. So, uh, Artyom, let's pick her up now? No way in hell. I can... I can walk just fine. I'll just rest a bit and get going. <laughs> the old man's probably going seven sorts of crazy now, thinking his precious daughter got hurt or something. <clears throat> Dad, it's me. My radio battery died. I got it wet. Other than that, I'm fine. Artyom and the guys are here. Better now. Really, I am. Artyom, help us here. I... We... We have to go back now, I guess. Where... Where would you go? Those fanatics would eat you alive. Well, 